Your child's educational journey just got a whole lot brighter. Understanding RESPs gives you a powerful tool for your child's education. Optimize, invest, and withdraw strategically through a combination of stocks, bonds, mutual funds, and ETFs. If you're not sure what to invest in or how to set these up, be sure to consult with your financial advisor in order to maximize your contributions. Once it's time to withdraw for education, there are two buckets. The first being the post-secondary education withdrawal, or PSE. These are tax-free and only include your contributions. Secondly, there's the education assistance payments, or EAP, which is taxed in the hands of the beneficiary, which includes the investment growth as well as the grants. Now, some things don't always go as planned. That's why the government has given you four viable options if the RESP is not fully utilized for education. Number one, keep the account open. Secondly, replace the beneficiary with another child. Three, you could transfer the funds to another savings account, or you could close it with some tax implications. By tailoring your child's education planning to your unique circumstances, this is going to help you reach your financial goals faster as a family.